been to California, never been to LA. So I stay home and write these songs, pretend I'll make it someday. My friends are getting married, they're all settling down. So I lay here, watch the ceiling fan go round and round. And it's always gone. The beach or the life of James Dean and It kills me to think I'm a void in the pill I can't swallow Good afternoon, my friend. It is a cozy, cozy spring day. It is chilly outside like it's cold today it's raining it's kind of drizzling but it's cozy inside i made a warm chai my rooibos chai this is such a yummy drink it makes me so happy it just makes me happy to drink i i saw my friend sarah's story this morning she posted her sarah jackson she's amazing she is a nervous system she's one of my friends but she's a nervous system coach and she is just one of my favorite people and she posted on her story something called the good list where she wrote out just what is good in her day today and she wrote like the beautiful spring um blooms in her yard and her warm cup of tea and like her dog and then john 15 jesus's words in john 15 i thought that was so that was so good. It was so good. We'll use that word. The good list was good and it made me so happy and it made me want to think about like what my good list is. What is my good list today? And I was just thinking about everything and I'm like, okay, number one on my list is this cozy chai. Number two is this super adorable. I went and got coffee with my friend this morning. She came, she came into town because she had a dentist appointment actually. And so anyway, she's like, you want to go get a coffee before my appointment? So I went and got it. I actually went and got a chai this morning, but chai number two. But then I stopped at this really adorable store, and this is the best thing I've ever seen. I am head over heels for this shell. <laughs> so beautiful. I instantly saw it, and I was like, "You're coming home with me. You are. You are mine. This is a work of art. This is on my good list. I love it." so much and then speaking of seashells this is also on my good list my new little bookends these are beautiful marble bookends from world market i'm so in love with them that is also on my good list and then meester snuggled up is also on my good list he's asleep so we'll leave him alone then psalm 34 is also on my good list i love that so much i've been meditating on it all week and i love that i sought the lord and he answered me and delivered me from all of my fears I just love that so much. I'm just like savoring that in this season of my life and it's really lifted me up. It's really, really lifted me up. Every time that I can choose to be afraid, choose to worry about things that aren't happening even right now and it can just really kind of, but it has really lifted me up. It has really lifted me up so, so much, like deeply and meditating on even Psalm 23, I have been loving actually like visualizing that and visualizing walking by a stream of water and being led and by these green beautiful pastures and the sound of the stream flowing by over the rocks and the green pasture and just the trees and the hills and just God being there with me and leading me and walking next to me and it is healing and nourishing in so many ways so that is on my good list for today so we're gonna go to the farm right now and go pick up some goodies and then come back and i actually want to do some spring organizing i really need to do some spring cleaning in the pantry so badly and then don't even get me started on the room we don't have a garage so it's just been a bit tricky and we've had to like sell a lot of things anyway it's just been tricky to figure out like space wise around here so I really need to clean up that room but i also have some more computer work to do today so we're just gonna see what we can get done, but we're gonna hang out. I was gonna kind of start working on the herb garden, but it's very dreary and I kind of want to save it for like a nice 
warm spring day outside but let's go to the farm and then we will ugh, do our little haul when we get back i got a standing desk by the way which this is actually going to need to get moved into that room but that's the thing everything's kind of being reorganized I'm telling you this chai is life-giving and we're off to the farm let's go hopefully they still have blueberries left Let me show you what I got from Thrive Market because this is such a good, I have a lot of these things I've actually never bought before. So they're really fun and exciting. And they're actually having their friends and family sale right now. So it's just, they had so many amazing things on sale. So I just have to show you what I got. And I got some really incredible things. Let me show you what I got. First of all, I had to get this. So this was one of the things on sale, the I think it's sol solely. Somebody said it was solely that it was pronounced that way. I'm not sure, but it's the green banana pasta. Okay. So if you've seen this in my Thrive Market haul before, I was freaking out about it because this is, first of all, this is a prebiotic. So this actually feeds the good bacteria in your gut. And it is so important to have regular prebiotics, like be getting regular prebiotics in. The only ingredient in here is organic green banana. That is it, there's absolutely nothing else in here. And the amount of potassium is astronomical. There is 3,290 milligrams. That is 70%. That, no food even like touches this. This is more than coconut water, this is crazy. So there, that is three servings, so that's for the whole thing. But in one serving, there's over 1,000 milligrams, which is absolutely insane. And this is actually so delicious like I was very skeptical obviously like green banana pasta I don't know if that's gonna be good I don't know I tried it 10 out of 10 so good absolutely delicious I am totally getting this and that's why I love Thrive Market because I always discover new fun exciting foods that I've never seen before and they have it at the best price and it's the most convenient because it's literally delivered to your door. I can just order this from the comfort of my couch. It's so convenient. My sister really loves Thrive Market because she is just, you know, she just had her baby a few months ago. So it's great for like postpartum. And my other friend who I met up with and got coffee this morning, she loves Thrive Market as well because she lives a little bit further away. So she doesn't have access to, you know, a f like grocery stores that have the things that she wants to buy, you know, more of just the options that she's looking for. Next thing, these are my favorite. I love that Thrive Market carries these as well. This is the traditional, these are the pho rice noodles and they're 100% organic heirloom rice. And we love to make pho in our pressure cooker. And this is definitely our favorite for noodles. So this is the Lotus Foods. And these are definitely the best price on Thrive Market, hands down for those kind of noodles. Oh my gosh, I'm really excited about these. I've never seen so many amazing reviews. The, this is actually Thrive Market brand. These are the pit green olive sea salt imported from Italy the only ingredient is olives and sea salt that is it and the reviews on these were absolutely amazing I was kind of thinking of like this would be so fun to just throw into a little cooler and have as a snack and just you know take it to the beach and have you know I love that it's like little individual snacks you have to do a little taste steps of these because people were raving about them oh my gosh I am so excited and this is why I love Thrive Market so much because not only do I obviously like get some of my favorite favorite foods, but I get my beauty products. And it's so funny because I just ran out of this literally yesterday. So this was perfect timing. This is the RMS Beauty Uncover Up Concealer. This is amazing. This is a clean concealer and I have been using this since 2018 and I always order it on Thrive Market. It lasts forever. And the first ingredient is coconut oil. The second ingredient is castor oil. Are you kidding me? The third ingredient is beeswax, then cocoa, then jojoba seed oil, then vitamin E, rosemary, and then titanium dioxide and iron dioxide. So that is it. That is what is in this concealer. I am shade 22. And again, I have used this for 
literally years. It is my absolute favorite concealer of all time. It is, oh, it's so nice to have a fresh one. My other one was just, it lasts for so long as well. So this is the color that I'm in. Oh, I love a new makeup product and just how, isn't that just like a nice sight to see? Like it just makes me happy to look at, but this RMS Beauty is amazing and Thrive Market has the best prices for RMS Beauty. That's the thing, you know, you can get your beauty products. We get our, uh, this is literally, this is from Thrive Market. We get our soap that we wash our dishes with, our non-toxic soap. We get our food, like our favorite foods. You can get so many different things. They carry so many different items. Again, they're having their friends and family sale, so I took advantage of the sale. Okay, so these, these were also part of the sale. These are the Mary Ruth's Organic Lymphatic Support, and I, just, I really was drawn to these because again, I don't have anything that's like a lymph support that you would take. I'm really excited about this though. This has echinacea and elderberry plantain leaf, but I was reading the reviews on this and this looks so incredible for just lymph support, lymph support and drainage, which is really important to keep our drainage pathways open. The reviews were amazing and it was a part of the sale. So I threw that in my cart and I'm really excited to try it. So I'll let you know what I think, but I also, this is very excited. This is a 15 month supply of iodine. So this is organic iodine drops and this is potassium iodide. So 250 micrograms. And you only, again, you only need two drops. And I was actually looking specifically for a new iodine that was actually a lower dose than the one that I'm currently uh, taking regularly. And so I saw this one, this was on such a good sale that I was like, I have to throw this in my car. It is such a good deal. Just two drops a day. And I absolutely love that. So I'm going to be adding that into my water. I love this because this is just such an easy way. You know, I'm not regularly eating seaweed all the time and I try to eat seafood as much as I can, but this is just so incredibly helpful. So just a couple drops and I'm really excited to try this one. And I like that it's a dropper because it's just so much, I feel like it's just easier to take, you know, just like a couple drops in your water. I don't know, you're not swallowing anything to me. It just feels like less of a barrier, like it's easier. So very excited about that. And that was included in the sale. And then I'm so excited because you know, I just kind of got back on my kombucha train and I saw that Thrive Market carries this. I was like, what am I doing? What am I doing with my life? It was so much cheaper on Thrive Market, the kombucha. And I got a flavor that I've actually never tried before. So it is a little bit later in the day, but I really want to try it. And I really want to see how it tastes. Or it's been years since I've even had this, maybe. I don't know. I don't remember if I've even had this. This is the Synergy Guava Goddess uh, flavor. And... Oh, it looks so good. I actually think one of you commented and said that Guava Goddess was your favorite flavor. And then also the peach, but I specifically got the Guava Goddess this time. So nine billion living probiotics. Okay, literally one of the first ones up there on the list is Saccharomyces boulardii that's in this blend, which is so incredibly helpful because as you know, when we lived in our moldy uh, little condo there and I just got my pathogen test results back, Saccharomyces boulardii is amazing. If, you know, for me personally dealing with mold exposure, it is incredibly beneficial to our gut and really helps to repopulate the gut with that good bacteria. So the fact that this was the, like the second probiotic on here, I was just like, oh my gosh. And then I was freaking out about the glucuronic acid because it has glucuronic acid in here, which is amazing for liver support. And when we support the liver, then we are supporting ultimately our hormones because the liver clears out all those old uh, excess hormones to get them out of the body. And when we support the liver with something like glucuronic acid, it helps the body, it helps the liver to perform those detoxification pathways. So this is amazing for detoxification support. I was just so impressed by all the different strains in here, 9 billion probiotics. So, you know, we just need to try this flavor because I really, really want to try it. So... I'm gonna have a sip and then probably Bo will have to finish it off because I can't have caffeine because this is obviously like tea. So let's try it, here we go. Oh my gosh, that is so delicious. Are you kidding me? Okay, that is amazing. And you know how I am with my drinks, very picky. I have very high standards and this 
is absolutely fantastic. Synergy just really never lets me down, but man, the guava is really good. And I wanna see how much I paid for that. This was only $2.99 a bottle, which is absolutely amazing. So much cheaper than I've ever seen it ever in stores. And then my Lotus Foods, I can't even believe this was only $2.99. This was 46% off. It's usually $5.49. This was 38% off. It was only $7.49. My iodine drops were 39% off. These were usually almost $22 and they were only $13.47. And it is literally, what did it say, a 15 month supply. Okay, and then this, I've actually never found this in stores before, but this is usually $3.99. And on Thrive Market, 31% off. It was only $2.77 a box. No, this is one of my favorite things. I discovered this brand on Thrive Market as well. And I just like, it is my is one of my favorite things ever to drink. I always have to throw it in my cart now because it's so good. These are the Tapachi Grapefruit Lime Paloma Fermented. These are also a prebiotic. So this actually has in here the agave inulin, which feeds the good bacteria in your gut and really is so amazing for blood sugar regulation because the inulin specifically feeds a bacteria called acromancia. And acromancia helps us with blood sugar regulation and I'm telling you, the foundation of hormone health is blood sugar regulation. Okay, that is like one of the foundations. And so, but how crazy that gut health is also a foundation. And when we support our gut and we feed it the prebiotics, then you support the blood sugar regulation. So it's uh, it's all interconnected. And that is what makes me love this drink because you're feeding your gut, you're supporting your blood sugar. It is absolutely delicious. And the grapefruit lime Paloma flavor is so good. I actually really like the prickly, pa uh, prickly pear or like prickly, prickly pear. I think it's like prickly pear cactus, something like that. I really like that flavor too, but I absolutely love the grapefruit lime Paloma flavor. It's so delicious. So throw this, throw a couple of these in your Thrive Market cart. They're just so delicious. And this is such a good time to join Thrive Market because in addition to my 30% off and the free gift worth up to $60, they're doing their friends and family sale through the 24th. So this is the time to join Thrive Market and shop the friends and family sale. I'm telling you, you can get the best deal, save the most money. It's so affordable, whether you live far away from a grocery store and you can't can't find things that you want or whether you're in a season of life that's hard to make it to the grocery store, it makes it so convenient that you can literally sit on your couch, order your groceries with just a few taps from your finger and you're done and it's delivered to your house and you save a ton of money because you, you know, even me going right down the road, like I'm not gonna pay double for something that I can literally order on Thrive Market and conveniently get it delivered to my house. I truly love them so much. So link is in the description box or you can go to thrivemarket.com slash CambriaJoyYT. You're gonna get 30% off of your first order and a free gift worth up to $60. And again, this is their friends and family sale. So this is like the perfect time to join if you are not a member yet. I saved so much money on every single order. So I saved $34.91 on today's order. Imagine being at the grocery store and they're like, we're just gonna take $35 off of your bill. You'd be like, huh? What? I'm gonna take off this and this and this and this. That's amazing. So very exciting. So link is in the description box. This is really exciting. Okay, so I went and they use, they have herbs there that they sell, but I just checked the herbs the other day and they did not have like any herbs. So when I went today, I was like, what is going on? And I was talking to one of the ladies and I had all my herbs and I, and she was like, oh my gosh, you got so, you got so many good ones. And I was like, yeah, I've never, I, I like last week I checked and there was like no herbs. And she was like, yeah, we get in a fresh, like a fresh batch every single week and they sell so fast. So this is perfect. Like you got in at a perfect time. I was like, yes, because they had so many different herbs. So I'm really excited to be like, slow down my talking, but I'm so excited because I'm going to get to plant my herb garden. So thank you for helping me with that. I'm so excited to get to plant this. And one of you actually said to plant more of like medicinal herbs, like lemon balm, holy basil, and kind of those types of herbs. And I actually have a book that has a bunch of recipes, like syrups and yeah, just like different like tonics and different drinks and um, basically just, you know, different ideas to use with your herbs. Let me show you all the herbs I got for our herb garden. So we definitely gonna have to plant this. Maybe we'll plant it tomorrow. I'm not really sure. Just because today is a little bit gloomy and it's getting a little bit late. But first of all, this is holy basil. So this is the first herb that I got. And it's funny because Bo actually has used holy basil um, coming out of that moldy apartment. The one thing that really helped calm down his histamines and just even his nervous system and his mind is holy basil. So 
how cool that I'm so excited that I'm gonna get to have this and it's already grown, but you know, grow it in the backyard. I'm really, I'm just so looking forward to plant this and it just seems like such a fun, just a fun thing to do, a fun hobby, and I'm really excited to kind of get into this. So let me know if you have any tips with herb gardens, like anything like that. I'm not sure, we kind of want to do like a barrel, a um, an actual wine barrel, but I don't know if like the roots, like if certain plants are gonna take over, if it's gonna become too competitive in the soil, I, I'm not really sure. So I don't know if I should, but then I don't know if I should plant them in single pots because I don't know if that's, you know, too restrictive for their growth. So I really just don't know. I'm not sure what to do. Maybe I'm overthinking it. I probably definitely am. But if you have any tips, seriously, let me know. But the next thing that I got is lemon balm, which is also incredibly powerful for calming nervous system support. And, ooh, it actually, you know, it kind of actually smells like lemon grass, which is really interesting, but I was really excited to see that they had lemon balm there. And then I also picked up, this is onion candy. So this is a Walla Walla type sweet mild storage onion. I thought that I grabbed, there was a different one that looked exactly like this that said it was like a, a Japanese style sweet scallion or something like that. I just, I, I'll probably go back and get more because she said that they're having like another sale event that they're coming up with that has a ton of herbs that's coming. So I'm really excited about that. But this is mint and this smells so good. And when we were living, when we were like renting for my parents at the other house, they oh, they had mint in their yard and I loved picking fresh mint and making fresh mint tea or just adding it into water. It was so nice to go out in the backyard and pick some fresh mint. So I was really excited to see that they had mint. And then I also picked up some sage, which that's very exciting. I love fresh sage and like frying it up in some butter and adding it into a dish, like obviously, especially like around fall. And then this one is parsley. So we got some parsley, very cleansing, very nourishing to the blood. And then what else? Um, I think that's all of my herbs. I cannot wait to plant the herb garden with you. And then I did pick up some more strawberries and blueberries. Oh my gosh, those blueberry muffins, I'm telling you. They're like the best muffins I've ever made. So nothing beats farm fresh blueberries. Okay, I picked up some more cilantro. And then, oh, that smells so good and so fresh. And then I grabbed a couple of asparagus. Asparagus is my favorite vegetable right now. I absolutely love cooking this up in the morning and then doing a couple poached eggs on it with some parmesan reggiano it is so so delicious the poached eggs like the runny egg yolk over the asparagus that's been seared is so delicious i cannot explain and it's like the perfect spring breakfast so i grabbed some more garlic i really want to make more chimichurri it's been a while since i made my chimichurri and then some lime apple and then um i've really been liking our little butternut squash in the uh, our place cooker that little tiny miniature i think it's called the wonder oven it roasts your veggies so fast and i was like this is perfect i should just chop this up and roast it in our wonder oven last but not least some avocado so that is what i got from the farm but let me show you last but not least what i actually picked up really quickly from the store i picked up oh these are so good these um why don't i ever know how to pronounce the name of these i forgot about this this lemon flavor it's like a it's a really protein rich there's 10 grams of protein in it but the lemon flavor is so fresh and delicious and perfect for spring. So I picked up some more heavy whipping cream. Oh, that chai earlier, this is the one that I use for the chai. It's so good. I really like this Clover brand because this is just organic cream. There's no thickeners. A lot of them will surprise you with thickeners in there, and that could be really irritating to the digestive system. That's the thing. When I was dairy-free for a really long time and I would swap out, I would actually like eat um, like the coconut milk ice cream a lot of those ice creams would still hurt my stomach and I just thought it was like just me, but they have thickeners in there to make it more like dairy, to make it more of like a thick. So that's the thickener, thick, to make it more thick, obviously. And, but that's the thing is that they can be really irritating to the digestive system. So that, I really like that. That doesn't have any thickeners in it. It's just the cream. And then more, I, I picked up a lot of grass fed meat because we were really running low on our meat. We were really out of it. So, and I picked up some more short ribs. So stocking back up our freezer. And then they had organic purple sweet potatoes. Last but not least, this is actually a really big haul. <laughs> but hey, I love, I love a good grocery haul. Picked up some red onion because we were out of that. And I really love the barbecue chicken wrap that I made in my what I eat in a week video so delicious. So I wanted to get more red onions so that I could make that. That was like the most delicious wrap. Such a good lunch. And then I picked up some salmon. They actually had fresh king salmon and I've never seen them have that there. I picked up some salmon to get in 
are really good omegas and uh, just it's so, so good to have seafood like regularly in your diet, especially that I'm focusing on, you know, preconception health. I really, really am trying to incorporate as much seafood as I can. I try to aim for like four times a week to have seafood. So salmon, shrimp, uh, scallops even sometimes, um, but really salmon and shrimp are like my main two. And then even like mahi mahi, Costco, really I get the bulk of our seafood from Costco because it's just a really affordable way to get the wild caught. But I was really happy to see that they had fresh salmon. So I picked that up. People got marrow bone. So something else that I'm really including in my preconception, uh, just, you know, nutrition is bone broth. And so, and it's been so easy to make it with our pressure cooker, the the uh, one from our place. I'm telling you that is like revolutionized um, my bone broth game. It is so easy and quick to make bone broth. It takes two hours and it makes the most gelatinous bone broth that you've ever had in your life. Can you get my hoodie off? Sure. Ah, <laughs> I really, yeah, these had amazing reviews. It's just olives and salt. Oh, how is it? Very good. Is it very good? I always like pit it all. You do? Yeah, they're great. Mmm. Ooh. Mm. Wow, those are really good. Here, I just opened this one. Do you want this? Ooh, guac. Try it out. Thri yeah, Thrive Market. Such a good deal on Thrive. Ooh, that's very good. That's a really good one, huh? I think really? this, this one might be my new favorite. Yeah. Guava. Yeah, guava's really good. Mm. Isn't that amazing? Yeah. It's so refreshing. Mm, I like this. I like that one, too. Mm. Yeah. It's like that. Okay, this worked out so perfectly because I picked up that salmon and then I was like, what are, what are we gonna do for the side? I thought potato is gonna take like an hour to make and then we're kind of hungry right now. I was like, this is perfect. So last time with this too, I did like capers, lemon, garlic, that kind of thing. So this with the salmon is going to be a perfect dinner. And then I'll probably just throw in some asparagus. So we'll have asparagus and mix that in with the pasta and then put the salmon on top and it's just gonna be a fabulous dinner. So easy, it's probably gonna come together in, this takes three to four minutes to cook. This dinner is going to be ready like in 15 minutes. My favorite way to make salmon, as you saw, I sear it up in some ghee for like three minutes just to get like a nice, cru like a crispy, the skin side is up. So you want the salmon like directly touching the pan. Sear that in there for a couple minutes to get it nice and crispy. And then I finish it off in the oven at like 415 for just a few minutes. And it makes perfect salmon every single time. So flaky, but so it has that beautiful like outside and it tastes like restaurant salmon. It is so good. And it's such a quick fast protein to make for dinner. So that's what we're gonna have for dinner. I'm really excited for this dinner because it came together so quick. It's gonna be so nourishing and I'm just, I think the flavors are gonna be fantastic. I thought I would show you some of the products that I've been recently adding into my routine. So as you know, when I got the test back because we lived in mold, my body's actually making antibodies against black mold, which is you know, I'm just trying to stay positive about it and I'm just so thankful. I really am so incredibly thankful that I just have the ability as a practitioner to do these kind of functional testing. I'm just trying to genuinely keep a good attitude about it and just be so thankful to God that I have answers, that I've figured it out, that, you know, so many different things with my, you know, from gut health testing to anyway, pathogen testing. So anyway, so as you know, we lived in that moldy condo and also I lived in mold in 2015, which was so funny because some of you said, I remember when you were getting sick all the time and mold is like the most powerful immunosuppressant. So anyway, I thought I would share with you, I do take the Symbiotica Shilajit, which has fulvic, fulvic acid and also humic acid, which is really, really helpful for mold. But I also wanted um, this this specific one. I really, I'm just trying to add in as much support as I possibly can. So this is the Wild Holistic. These are the Earth Drops Micronutrient Gut Support. So that's the thing, fulvic and humic acid, which is why Shilaji is so incredibly powerful. So I'm kind of doing both, to be honest with you. But I just thought I would share because I really like chatting about this kind of stuff. So this is amazing though, because fulvic and, fulvic and humic acid really help the gut to actually absorb more nutrients like from your food which is amazing so you're already eating your food you might as well maximize the absorption of all of those nutrients so and I've been feeling so good on this and getting back in my 
Sheila Jeet uh, routine again. Like it's been amazing. So I really like this. I like that it's in like a tincture dropper form. I've honestly just been doing both. And then also something I, I don't think I've really shared this, but every single day I take, I do, um, I actually got this from, Thri this is something to put in your Thrive cart. I am telling you. I take Armor Colostrum. I take um, I take these Rishi drops now from Wild Holistic. I the, this says longevity support, and um, it's it's nourishing to the liver, the heart, and really ultimately this is very calming and relaxing. And mold can make you very very anxious, and so that's the thing. Like Rishi is such a powerful support. I love that God made so many amazing things. So let me turn down this fan really quick because I feel like it's just really loud. But this is amazing for being. Calm. Calm. And it's so interesting to me because even women who take Rishi and have it during their pregnancy, there's something called a Rishi baby where um, it's kind of been coined as that where their babies are just very calm. And it's very interesting to me. I just thought that was, you know, something that's very curious and very interesting to me. But anyway, so I've been taking this just to help with that, just for calming. And obviously it's like super nourishing for immunity as well. But I'm really enjoying that. And then the last thing I got, this is the Nourished Body. So when I am not on top of my mineral tea, which is so powerful and rich in minerals, and I don't have my mineral tea, this is great because look at this blend. This has, the first thing in here is nettle leaf, then it's moringa, which I've actually heard amazing things about moringa before. Alfalfa, red, raspberry, and then it has horsetail, acai, I've really heard amazing things about yellow dock root too for hormone and like womb support. Um, specifically the nettle, red raspberry, and the yellow dock were like the things that I was really drawn to in this blend. And then the goji berry and then orange extract. So this I am really doing for like, honestly like womb nourishment support. I always sneak in an extra spray. I love the taste of propolis. It is so good. And they sell it on Thrive Market too, which is amazing. Dinner came together so fast. I put some Parmesan Reggiano on top of the asparagus and just sauteed that in some ghee. And then the salmon over the green banana pasta it looks so good. Is it super yummy? Really good is it really good? Are you supposed to eat the skin? Yeah, I've been I eating it. I feel like I'm like. I've been eating the skin. Absolutely. Oh. That is literally, per this is better than a restaurant. Mm. This is restaurant style. That is the per, that salmon is perfectly cooked. Yeah. Meester's literally crying. You go for a 10,000 step walk with me? Sure, why not? What am I at right now? I'm at, I'm in want, Blue's Clues and he says, my handy dandy notebook. Mm. My handy dandy pedometer. 4,590. Gonna get my steps in. <laughs> did it we did it i'm so surprised and happy my goal has been to get my 10,000 every day so here it is I'm telling you this little pedometer it's amazing what happens when you just have a little bit of objective information it's personally really motivating for me to be like okay i can go for a little walk after dinner plus it's really good for your digestion so i'm feeling really good i feel pretty relaxed and i'm actually sweating so that was probably like a 40 I just went really leisurely. I was responding to all of your comments. So we didn't get to do our, let me just show you what we're working with tomorrow. This is what we really need to tackle tomorrow. This is really just not working for me at all. And it's extremely disorganized and it's just way too chaotic in here. Definitely a spring cleaning project that I've needed to tackle. Do you want to eat a carrot? Oh, me sir. This is the progress I've made so far. That up there is just a bunch of KitchenAid stuff. This, I kept all of this pretty much the same. This is just a bunch of my flowers that, and my flower blends that I use to make my gluten-free flower blends. So, you know, like the tapioca flour, arrowroot and stuff like that. And then I need to get to the bottom of this, but I'm just gonna work on these two or these three first. And then I'll tackle this bottom part right here. But this is pretty much, that's good for me. Everything's in its container and I can see it, so.
oh, I feel like a new person. <laughs> I'm kind of losing my voice, but I just cannot believe this. This is, this is one million times better and it did not even take that long. So have all of our pastas and things like that up here. Love all the delicious rice noodles for our pho and jovial. Oh my gosh, I'm so losing my voice. <laughs> I'm actually, I never got a chance to do this right after the day that I filmed that. So we're back from our anniversary trip and we had some guests in town like right after. So I just lose my voice so easily anyways. So in here, I just have random, I have a lot of, I need to rip that off, but I have a lot of bags. But honestly, I feel like this worked out really well and I don't really find it completely necessary or it just might be honestly just unrealistic and kind of just a little bit too overwhelming for me personally to put every single thing in a container. I'm just gonna leave it in the bag that it's in. And honestly, I feel like this is working really well, the different baskets, because everything is really easily accessible and very organized to me now. And I don't, I, I'm not really, I just wanted it, I don't care about it being perfect. I just want it to be functional and organized so that I can actually use it. So uh, in here, I have things like coconut flour, the green banana flour, some beans from the local farm. This worked out really well with all my aloe juice and MCT oil, coconut butter, some vinegars. Love the jovial beans. These are so great because they're actually pressure cooked. They're fabulous. Love that coconut milk. I actually re need to re restock from Thrive Market. And then some canned goods. And then down here, we have more of the bags and packaged things. So our pho noodles, goji berries, mulberries, some, all of our coconut back there. And then just our rolled oats. These are really, this rice ramen is really good, gluten-free. And then pancake mix, inulin some vanilla and then some extra spices down there and then again this is all of my flowers my gluten-free flowers psyllium husk down here is kind of random but it's organized enough for me <laughs> and again i don't care about it being perfect but i have bulk raisins and cr uh craisins well i guess they are craisins cranberries but and then potatoes in here and we're all all out of onions right now but i'll put onions in there and then meester's treats so and some laundry stuff because we don't we don't have this is the only closet that we have i feel like it's very functional this makes me feel so much better looking at this and of course we have our salt refills and everything like that so that is that felt so nice. That's our little spring cleaning project. And it's all done and it didn't even take me that long and it's so much more functional and it's just so much better. So yay, we did it. Okay, that felt so nice to get that done. I'm totally losing my voice, but I'm so glad that that's done and that was such a nice spring cleaning project. So the next one is that room because ever since we moved in, we don't have a garage. We just have very... We gotta be we gotta work with our space here, you know. So it is a little bit tricky to not have a garage. So that room has kind of become like a lot of storage. And we don't have room for a dresser in our bedroom. So it's just been a bit tricky to figure out space. But that is my next spring cleaning project, this little room back here. So one spring cleaning project down, the next one to go, but Thanks for hanging out with me. It was so much fun. Don't forget, you can go to thrivemarket.com slash cambriajoyyt. This really is such a good time to join because they are having their friends and family sale. And as you can see in my pantry, there's so many different things that I love to get from Thrive Market. It's just literally the most, you get the best stuff at the best price. That's really what it is in the comfort of your own home. So Link will be in the description. I love you so much. Thanks for hanging out with me and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.